we are taking some comfort in knowing that you two are together forever and neither of you had to suffer like we are suffering now. You were like a lock and a key, each pretty useless on your own. But together, you unlocked the whole world for yourselves and for us and for so many others. We promise to carry on your legacy of greatness and giving from now until forever. To my father, you are my hero. And I don't mean that like how other, I don't mean that like how all dads are heroes to their sons. You were a real life superhero. When I was a kid in elementary school, we did these book reports on great Canadians. And I would always choose someone like Wayne Gretzky or Terry Fox. I didn't know at that time that you were one of those types of people. What it means to me to be a great Canadian is to set an example for the world to see. To be successful in business and make contributions to charity and to advance the quality and access of much needed healthcare and education and to raise a family. That is what it means to be a great Canadian. You contributed enormously to so many fields and have received so many honors and awards. I could not begin to name them off. To me, each new award was just another in the pile and no additional award was going to alter my perception of your greatness. But just two weeks ago, you privately told our family that you had been appointed to the Order of Canada, the greatest recognition of Canadian greatness. You were always so humble but I know how proud you were to get that news and how excited you were to finally be recognized for what you are. I don't know what, what will happen now with that award, if anything. But to our family, you were always the greatest Canadian. <laughs>